Car chassis explained. The vehicle's engine and transmission loads, as well as other parts and people inside, are supported by the chassis. It is a sturdy metal frame that is capable of carrying a whole load of a car in a static or dynamic condition. As the title suggests, we'll break down the explanation of your car chassis, covering the fundamentals. Let's get to it. Definition of a car chassis. A car chassis is a load-bearing structure that supports the load of a vehicle. In other words, the term chassis should be used to describe the portion of a car's structure that carries weight. The vehicle's horizontal segment is what joins the other parts of the construction together. The chassis is a group of mechanical parts that enable the drive unit to transmit power to the wheels. Function of the chassis. The function of the chassis is to sustain not just the components and occupants of the car, but also the engine and transmission loads. It provides space for mounting other necessities like the engine, brake, etc. to the vehicle. The chassis withstands the stresses arising due to bad road conditions. It also withstands stresses during braking and acceleration of the vehicle. If you have found this video to be interesting, just a friendly reminder to subscribe to our channel if you haven't already. And let's continue with the video. Type of car chassis. 1. Tubular space frame. A tubular space frame made of steel pipe-shaped chassis is used to directly shape automobiles according to their construction. The strength of the welded joints determines the chassis's caliber. This type of chassis is considered the best due to its toughness and is frequently used in racing cars because of this advantage. 2. Ladder frame. A ladder frame chassis, resembling a ladder, is ideal for supporting vehicle engine mounts and other components despite its unconventional design. Typically made of symmetrical steel with a beam shape, this chassis is reinforced with additional joints and cross members. It is commonly used in SUV automobiles. 3. Backbone chassis. The primary structure of the chassis gives it the appearance of a single skeleton. It connects the front and back of the car by running through the center. The backbone chassis is also known as a single chassis, but it has several drawbacks such as its high cost. 4. Monocoque chassis. A monocoque chassis integrates with the vehicle's body, serving as a component of the exterior that protects the interior in case of crashes. It is usually made of reinforced composite steel to also function as the frame of the car's body. The main requirement for chassis material is its strength to support the vehicle's weight. 5. Aluminum space frame. The aluminum space frame chassis is made of aluminum instead of steel, while monocoque chassis typically use steel plate sheets. This aluminum chassis is lighter than the monocoque. Part of car chassis. Transmission. Universal joint. Rear axle. Steering system. Clutch. Spring. Shock absorber. Stabilizer bar. Braking system. Wheels and tires. The automotive chassis serves as the foundational backbone of a vehicle playing a critical role in managing the forces and stresses encountered during various driving conditions. When navigating rough roads or accelerating, the suspension system relies on the chassis to endure these challenges, ensuring stability and performance. If you're new to our channel, make sure to subscribe for more content like this. Don't forget to like the video and leave a comment if you have any thoughts. And we'll see you in the next one.